As a business, uh, we return an awful lot of our turnover uh, into R&D. So we tend to um, bring to the market a regular uh, range of new products and services all the time. But it's important to note that all of that development uh, is purely client driven. Uh, we have, for instance, an extremely active user group that dictate both the shape and the pace of what and when we bring to the market. Um, we also have, that's a direct feed via our clients. What we also listen to is a wider feedback range throughout the whole industry. We have within our business, for instance, a group called the VBC, the Virtual Business Client. What they do is they take feedback from industry noise, industry requests, industry frustrations, and feed it back into our development strategy. Having said all of that, in terms of key products, what we have now is we have a, a mobile first uh, philosophy taking us forward for the next, at least the next five to 10 years. What we mean by that is we, we've developed uh, a range of uh, products sat on a platform, started uh, with our Go mobile, mobile development that actually covers uh, the understanding that people now want a seamless, from smartphone to tablet to PC solution that behaves the same and looks the same. So we can extend the products and services not just to uh, an FM provider, but also to the end consumers of that service. FSI make no assumptions whatsoever about the shape uh, of what the market wants. As I said before, we are completely market driven. And what we've heard loud and clear and reacting to is the need for flexibility uh, within a product. Now, the shape of FM is almost unrecognizable to what it was, say, 10, 15 years ago. And what we mean by that is that the, the, the huge breadth and range of what an FM is now required to provide uh, is almost limitless. And for that, what that does, it creates a, a unique challenge for FM managers when it comes to the use of systems. So their systems are being challenged to produce and accommodate products and services that were never envisaged. So what they need is they need a product that can change shape or a product that can be rapidly developed to accommodate any new developments or any new sector they may go after. And our mobile first philosophy, which is a platform upon which you can develop and create any application, uh, gives them limitless flexibility. We've been doing trade shows like this for the last 17 years. Uh, we were there at the very beginning uh, when these trade shows really started to take shape. And as most of the people here will know, uh, we were also at Birmingham uh, for many, many years. The facilities show itself um, is, is still the premier show for facilities management it, within its calendar. We're lucky in having um, uh, a presence in the Middle East and Asia Pacific with a number of agents uh, in other key parts of the world, notably Canada, South Africa and one or two others. Uh, and what, what we have as a business we, is we have all year round coverage uh, to let the marketplace know about our products and services. But in terms of the UK, this is the number one show. What we like uh, about the show and its current form is that London based means that the lasso that UBM, the organizers are able to, to throw encompasses a, a, an international audience. So people uh, who typically may have thought twice about coming to Birmingham are happy to get on a plane and they're within a few minutes of landing within the UK uh, to excel. With, with unique products, what we've done is we've hit upon uh, a key visual exception reporting tool in the form of a, a new product called Live View. What that does is uh, give a very, very simple, um, global if necessary, can be regional, view of hotspots. Um, so you configure a threshold uh, at which you want to be alerted. It could be, for instance, show me when within our sites in Birmingham or this or head office uh, has any any uh, calls or any uh, statutory um, jobs about to breach, send me a text, change this, change this uh, map to red. And it's a very, very simple visual alert without you needing to trawl through reams and reams of reports. What makes us unique or what FSI is, uh, it, it's really, really simple. Um, there is, if you look around the trade show, for instance, there is a proliferation of people that purport to do exactly what we do. Um, we've been doing it for 25 years. In fact, this year is our 25th anniversary. 
And what we do is, is ensure that people know that we're not just a technology for technology's sake company. So we, we actually say, we walk the walk and talk the talk. Uh, we deliver uh, what it is we say we provide. So we have a, a large team of consultants that implement and configure and train on our product sets. Uh, we have a range of key account managers that look after our clients outside of projects. Uh, that's challenging when we have uh, continually uh, um, a large number of um, startup companies that on the face of it seem to do what we do. What makes us unique is the, is the people behind the product.